Hello and welcome back to another Mother Shadows video. Myself Liam. Today I'm commentating over another one of James's pre recorded boss battle fights. Today you have two of the best bosses in the game. You have the Mantis against Director Schmechter. Now, this is probably going to be one of the final boss battles because, like I said, and I'm just going to say this now, so pretty much James is recording everything for me. And I know a lot of you are asking and putting in requests and stuff like that. If I was there, if I did have my PC, I would be going through and doing these requests in like a big video or like this, doing them in shorter stints, like four minute videos or something like that. But obviously I'm not there. I don't know if any of you have heard. I've said it God knows how many times now, but I guess some of you either don't listen or don't really pay attention. Um, I'm not there. I'm, I'm in South America for four months until December. I've been gone for about a month now, so anything you're seeing that I've edited has been pre-edited, pre-recorded. Anything you're seeing that's new of the Grounded 1.0 update is because James or Marcus have recorded, have uploaded the stuff, and I've commentated over it. Or James has just uploaded some stuff by himself. Uh, so again, big thank you to them for doing that. So yeah, obviously I can't, I know you guys are giving him requests and stuff like that, but James has stuff he has to do, he's still working and stuff like that, so you're sending him requests and sometimes he can't get them done. And also on top of that, with the new update and the recent update before that, they've changed some of the ways you can spawn in bugs using the Unreal Engine. So it's really, really difficult now to spawn in a load of bugs at the same time. Pretty much, I'll explain it. If you want to spawn in, say, the Mantis or Director Schmechter, you have to legit go and spawn them in in the world first. So then you can spawn them in spawn them in using commands, which is really difficult. So say if you want to spawn in, I don't know, 10 different insects or something like that, you have to go and spawn in each 10 of those things and then hope they stay spawned into the world, which the only way you can do that, you can spawn in a playable character, which acts as a character, even though it doesn't do anything. And it keeps them spawned in, but then it will lag the shit out of the server. So any, I don't know, big, huge bug battles are going to take a lot of time to do and are going to be very, very difficult to do. So, you know, have a bit of patience with that. I know I'm not really talking about the fight here. I'm just talking about stuff in general, but you can just listen to me whine on about pointless shit while you watch the fight in the background. Uh, another thing, James has been a big, big help, especially to you guys, to me as well and to you guys. He's gone through and unlocked all of the achievements and stuff on the game and made a game safe for you guys. And some of you guys still complain about it for some reason. I don't know why, which, to be honest, I'm just going to say it on his behalf. It pisses him off a lot because he's gone through a lot of effort, like a big, big amount of effort, like played countless hours, even though he probably doesn't want to most of the time. But he's played countless hours to try and make a save, unlock everything for you guys. If you haven't seen the video, I'll link it in the description. He's made quite a few of them, I think, two or three maybe, where he's unlocked stuff for you guys and done stuff like that. So uh, just show him a little bit of appreciation <laughs> instead of complaining in the comments because he's doing you all doing you all a favor there but but anyway that's just some updates on on our channel and grounded news so like i said anything coming out in the future there might be a few more of these new grounded 1.0 videos but i'm not too sure obviously like i said i'm not there anything that is coming out in the future or has come out recently usually about two times a week is going to be stuff that i've pre-recorded so if you're wondering and you're putting in the comments saying oh where's the new creatures where's this creature where's that creature for a start just check the date on the video because some of you comment on really old videos wondering why there's no new creatures or another one is because I pre-recorded them, just so you know. Uh, but anyway, this is the boss battle. I'm actually going to start talking about it now. Uh, I feel like the Mantis is going to win this because the Mantis is an absolute fucking tank. But this one is going to determine the best boss in Grounded because oh, he literally killed him. The Mantis is hands down the best boss in Grounded. There's no doubt about it. He's killed every single other boss. No doubt in my mind. And now he's trying to attack James. This guy has no fucking chill whatsoever. Uh, but yeah. Uh, now James is going to try his best to get it. Oh, sorry, James is the best in Grounded. Thanks. Bye! <laughs>